10 uh, pounds of Spoonbill uh, fillets. Oh my gosh. I've never had Spoonbill before, so I'm, I'm excited to try that. Look at that, baby. That was a 70 pound fish. 70 pounds, six, well, 68 pounds. <laughs> Cut us some for tonight. Yeah. Never had spoonbill before. Tastes like, just like sturgeon. I've never had sturgeon before. <laughs> it's good white fish. Are they a scaly fish? Um, no, skin. Skin? Like a catfish. Oh. How about sturgeon? Are they are they scaly? Nope, no scales. Sturgeon sturgeon has a uh, a um a jelly spine. So you gotta cut around their heads and twist it and you gotta pull it out. And if you break the spine, which is like a intestine, it releases poison, you gotta throw the fish away. Oh shit. Yeah, it's tricky, but it's fun. These are spoonbill. You can't ca catch them by. You gotta. You gotta hook. You gotta snare snag them. Snag, snag them. Snag yeah. Him. You gotta snag them with a treble hook, cause they they don't bite on on bait. But they are delish. Maybe my first time. First time trying it. And I'm gonna roll them in egg, and then roll them in yellow cornmeal. And fry them. Red meat, no good. That's iffy, but I think it'll be okay. I'm going to deep fry these, and that piece I'm going to bake with garlic and lemon. Ooh, that sounds good. Yep, I'm going to bake it in the oven and then broil it at the end to brown it. Beautiful, like always. But I, I heard you and smelled cooking down here, so I wanted to check before I started. Getting ready to make some hush puppies. Oh my gosh. And then this is what I was smelling upstairs. Yeah, potatoes and onions, always. Yep. In bacon yeah, grease. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we haven't started yet. No, nope, I'm waiting for the grease to get hot. All right. I had an extra box of dye in storage, so I used it. But then I remembered, I need two bottles of dye. Cause it never really, <laughs> it's never enough, I need more. See, look, it's brown here and it's black here, so. Yeah, I gotta remember that next time. I need two bottles of dye. Are you going to do the hush puppies and fish in the same? Yep. Okay. I'm going to do the hush puppies first and, and double dip my fish. Okay. Yeah, see how uneven the color is because I didn't have enough fucking dye? Oh my god, that's, that's going to bother the hell out of me. Look. Ugh. Oh well. I'm going to straighten it next, and then I'm going to cut the ends because they're super dry and gross. Yeah, I haven't really paid attention to my hair in a while, so got to take care of it. Oh, it made me so good. I love hush puppies. He's got bacon, wild garlic chives, 
and jalapenos in it. Both know how to cook really good. Mm-hmm. Different. Yeah. Totally different totally from each different. other. Yep. <laughs> Get out of here. Out of here. So Steve just finished the fish. Frying the fish. It just had a little piece. It's really good. I was upstairs straightening my hair. Potatoes. <clears throat> yep, it's Pesh puppies. Spoon bill. spoon bill. It's like meat. Mm. I, had a, I had a piece of that. I'm going to look at that. It's like a pork chop. Mm. Well, I just finished straightening it and cutting the tips. So, cut it okay. It's as even as it's going to be for an amateur. Someone who does not know how to cut hair, so. Yeah, it's the hair everywhere, but. Not too shabby. Oh my gosh, we still have so much unpacking to do. 